Um, but yeah, thank you. So thank you to uh, to Future Lab for hooking me up with the key for the Alice DLC. I think it's been out for a week now. Um, so I I don't really I don't know what what's in it. I haven't seen it. My nose is like super itchy now. Okay, so. Oh, okay. They're all like tucked in, tucked in here. Oh. I wish there would be like some mark. Well, I guess there is this little pop out thing. Probably, yeah. It's like this is the one that you don't have. Well, oh, it's a story. Is it saying that's what I need to do the job or what it's going to give me? Okay. <gasps> oh, my back hurts now. Oh, gosh. Whoa. Or, oh, wait, did I? All right. Oh, that's cool. Whoa. What? Um, it is open if uh, anyone wants to join in. Why does that feel so loud to me? Is it super loud? It does look like it's really loud. No, I'm gonna not stress and just trust that you guys will tell me if it's too much. Honestly, it's really clever of them to have like themed DLC. Like super clever. I did change the category, I think. Yeah, I did. It still seems like super loud to me. What the heck? Where's my... Is the music even audible? I just realized maybe it's not. You can? Okay. I'm fussing over things that I don't need to fuss again about. For a change.
I just wasn't like the no man's sky wasn't wasn't scratching the itch for me today. But that's that's totally okay. It's gonna suck going back to my normal washing gun thing after using this. Oh, there's an upside down door. This is fun because you can't, like, you don't know what's there until you get to it. Yeah, this is, this is like an Alice in Wonderland kind of thing. Why are you not dinging? Oh, there. I feel like power washing candles would not be great. You know, like... I suppose they're already a bit scuffed, aren't they? No, they're probably made of like Jack of Diamond cards or something. Or something else from the Queen of Hearts going on a murderous rampage. Oh, I just realized that's why it sounds so loud to me because I've got my headset on. But you still right make would make more sense, yes. Okay, good. I was I was like, how am I supposed to get underneath that chair? that thing. I held 
held off on this game for so long. I'm like, why? Why did I do that? I'm so glad I actually just went ahead and got it on Steam. That's a cute little picture. That would be really sweet if it was done in silk, like silk thread. It is. It's very grotty. I think that would be really cute as an embroidered picture. <sighs> So I got my yarn and I got my embroidery floss for my trip. And now I just want to play with my new craft materials. Apprentice, hello. Hi. Thank you for your support. Oh, oh. Wow, this door got melted. Man, that space for sale game was so he can cute. It was especially the snitches. Ugh, I love them. This is, uh, I'm not sure, actually, this is just the, the Alice, uh, DLC for, uh, other than it, for Power Wash Sim, um, and it's like a, a story, so it could be? Yeah, at the end of every day. It's interesting. Well, thank you. Yeah, I I got got. You done got me good. Got it. Yeah, I haven't you haven't got much yet. What this trippy hole we came down. I'm just sort of working on I don't know, like the the power wash equivalent of of cutting in. No, you have to do the wall too. I just kind of feel like when I do this, if I do like the the edges first, then it's easy to come back through and do like the the rest of it.
this is the 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 introduction to the Alice uh story, I guess. So like I don't think we've got onto the uh acid trip yet. It's, uh, yeah, there is actually. So there's, there is a story in the main game. And then, well, it, like you get like hints of stuff going on, uh, but I haven't got far enough in to really see what it is, but there, there is story. And the same there is supposed to be here. This is like a story mode for Alice, but I haven't the foggiest what it is. So there's like basically like a story mode and then there's just a, a, I don't know, like a free play mode as well where you can just do whatever you want, I guess. Yes, please. Oh, uh, what do you end up doing with the um, the suckers? The give them structure. That's how you get the stories here. You get these little, like, messages. I've just realized I should have my gloves on. No, Echo, they're like halfway between a cherry and a plum, plum size. They're... They're like... I don't know, one and a half, two inches around wide, maybe? They're like, they're like small plums. You a popcorn stitch. Oh, there you go. I'm putting my gloves on. Oh, oh wow. It's really good. I got my yarn for the shawl. It doesn't quite feel like the colors are what I wanted entirely, but I think it'll look nice still. The colors still remind me of Grandad and that's what I wanted. so cool holy heck luna i love it and the colors are amazing it 
it, wow. Man, you're so cool. And talented. And amazing. Oh, nice. So it was like a joint effort. See, now part of me wants to like go through and do all the floor first. And then another part's like, no, that's dumb. You do the floor last. love it the the um color gradient is like perfect to make myself something like that for winter. Not that I ever really need to wear hats. But like some sort of obnoxious, I don't know, like yellow to pink or purple to green or something really vibrant and bright. Man, this is really neat. Actually, I guess I probably ought to get the, um... Oh my god, it's so gross. At least get the foundation row for that blanket done. Yes, Justin, 100%. We started off with uh, a really cute uh, demo. Um, I think I posted about it in Molly and Drex's Discord called Space for Sale. I was going to do some No Man's Sky, but I wasn't feeling it, so figured we'd give this DLC a try since the devs were kind enough to hook me up. How you doing? Lazy day? That's good. You need lazy days. Everyone needs lazy days sometimes. Any 
can't even know, like... Start, way to finish. Okay. Um, but yeah, this is the new uh, Alice DLC. And it's already pretty... vibrant, I guess you could say. Trying to make use of the, uh, the, the camera lock. There. It's very, very cathartic. Like, I wasn't sure if I would like it, and I initially played it on Game Pass. Um, but I saw it was on sale with the Steam Summer Sale thing, and I was like, you know what, maybe I should just get it. Because I keep on thinking about playing it, but with it being on Game Pass, I'm like, eh. And I was like, if I keep on thinking about it, I probably want it. So I should just it and uh no regrets no regrets at all this is so pretty this is good i love this like the teak contrast and textures and colors but yeah we played this on um fourth of july and it was like the perfect sort of relaxy firework go boom kind of thing. I mean, same. I totally didn't just drive over a bunch of frogs in game for no reason at all. I've been, uh, I picked up, uh, Assassin's Creed again the other day. Uh, Valhalla. They were for a while, yeah. And, uh, <laughs> I can't believe people being like, we well, didn't know you were so bloodthirsty. I'm like, it's really fun. I get it, like, sneak around and stabinate people and set fire yeah it's like the perfect game for me i on tables i mean probably oh wait <laughs> yeah yeah no i do yeah you're right Everyone's like, oh, Dell. Dell is so nice and sweet. Is she, though? Is she? Man, doors. He can doors, man. Why are doors so hard? Oh, we added, uh, I added a riot emote uh, this week too. So there's a new animated emote for those of you who have access. It only seemed riot, uh, riot? It only seemed reasonable, fair, logical. That we have a, a B riot. It 
was a really tough call. I couldn't decide if I wanted the B to be like moving sideways. And then I saw I could make it like bounce up and down. I'm like, that's what I want. I'm like, cool, I'm never, I'm, I'm not done. Not at all. This, um, locked camera or unlocked cursor for the washer is perfect on this map. So I don't have to worry about getting motion sick. Our playlist is going to be kind of full of lullabies today, but I'm okay with that. I should post a picture of the, um... <laughs> the yarn. Oh. Oh. Burp. It's, it's a lot less, well, it's a, a lot lighter than I was expecting it to be. <laughs> oh God. It doesn't look anything like the picture. Oh, that is so gross. Oh, there's sparkly things. Oh, the door melted onto the floor. That's going to be a bitch to get out. It's like there's door all over the floor and cat prints. Cheshire cat. Hi, Jay. A loss. That's a pretty cool hat. Yeah, well, now, now you've got one that's tentacular. Yes, can confirm. 100%. A 
and glow in the dark too like that's pretty cool It's pretty neat yarn to do that. Because you never know when you need a hat that glows. Just never know. So many melty doors. Oh. I think my tummy is still clamoring for attention. See, I'll give it some time to brew and decide. That door handle is very low down for a door that's melted. Not that I'm an expert on melted doors, but it seems kind of low down. Oh, I didn't even think about the little bits of skirting board. Oh. <sighs> so I think tomorrow we'll we might revisit No Man's Sky. and just see if I'm feeling a little bit more open to it. But I think we're just going to cruise this week and just take it and play it by ear. I actually do need to start like organizing stuff. I've, I've just been putting shit into a box on my bed for my trip, but now I realize I'm getting picked up in less than a week. So I'm quite happy to just Plot, plot along and uh, with stream because it's it's an easy thing hmm I'm also very, very unimpressed that my period is due in the middle of next week. Like, that's some bullshit right there. Like, class A bullshit. What? 
So hopefully I am not going to be awful to travel with. Put the puttiest put put that ever put. Mario Kart again. Putty putty! Hi Poet. The little engine that put. Oh my god, I love that. Hi Poet. Thank you for the rain. How was Mario Kart? Did you win? Hi Sadie! Fancy seeing you in here. Thanks for coming over in the raid with Pud. Uh, for those of you who came over with Pud, hi. Hello. I'm Del. Deliria. My pronouns are she, her. And I'm... <laughs> I'm I'm playing with dirt. Fan put put. Is that a formal request? No. Wait, are you telling me what to do, put? Pud doesn't. Pud <laughs> Pud doesn't want me to ban. This is some trippy shit. You'll draw me a flower? I don't know, Mal, that's a pretty... That's a pretty good incentive to not... to not ban Pwn. Okay, I will accept a flower. I'm satisfied with that... that bargain. Art Pwn, yeah. Wait! What the heck? Every everyone, every, just put <laughs> bad deed, bad point. Hi, hello, clean. How was being a very nice person? No, actually. Hi. How was how was Storm? I was, uh, was? I am. I am, I, oh my god, I played the cutest fucking game earlier. Um, I was a, on a demo. I managed to get three hours of gameplay out of it. Big recommend. Uh, not sponsored, just really enjoyed it. Um, and yes, now we are, we're doing this, and hi, I'm Del, and I totally forgot how to do an intro. Hi. Hey! Thank you. Oh my god, less than a week now. Um. Thank you, Dean. Welcome in, everyone. Yes, stream summary, please. I need it. I will just clean all the dirty things that are in reach. Oh, also, we had a fun, uh, in, uh, a fun 
interlude for emergency potty break because apparently a lunch did not agree with me, so that was fun. You told a sentient runaway droid he was a woman's property and had to go back to her and then she had sex with it. I mean, right, what else are you supposed to do with a sentient runaway droid? Obviously, yeah. What else are droids for but sex? Except for maybe cleaning. To be honest, I think I'd probably just go for someone to do the dishes. I'm I'm not that picky. I will accept a, a dishwashing robot. Bane. Wow. Disappoints. Yeah, it's it's hard doing that stuff, man. It is it is not easy. Oh, thank you. It's it's not easy doing doing the the mean options. It does. I think that's like how in Mass Effect, uh, I've somehow ended up being like perfectly balanced between like Paragon and whatever the other one is. Because I'm pretty much like fuck everyone. Oh no, except for that person. And that person. Renegade, yeah. And, oh. Uh, fuck him especially, but not that person. <laughs> so, I just end up with it unintentionally. It's like teetering. Because I can never just be, like, me. Unless it's to Ashley, in which case, fuck her specifically, very much. And not in a fun way. I believe that's Paragon anyway, because it should be. so weird. <sighs> I quite like the floor actually. The uh, the teal colour. Yeah, so this is the new Alice DLC that dropped uh, this, this week. Yeah, I like it. Um... They, uh, apply, I applied for a key for it on Keymailer and it came through today and I was like, oh, okay. well, yesterday I was like, I guess I'll do this today then. So I, I don't have the Square Enix one. Yeah. Oh, maybe I do have the Warhammer one. I don't know. Do I? Hi, Clee? The, the Clee... Oh! I, I see where you're going with that name. Took me a bit. Had to find it. Hi. I'm going to call you Clee. Yeah, no, I don't have that one. Very clever. Very clever. Tell me 
many streamers have you managed to catch with that one out, I wonder? Uh, but yes, welcome in. Hello, good evening. The, the walls make me think of that uh, sherbet. You know when you go to like Chinese buffets and they have like the big tubs of sherbet? And it's always like, yeah, 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 rainbow sherbet. And it's always like, it's fruit flavored. And you're like, what the fuck flavor of fruit is this color? But okay, sure, I'll eat it because it's delicious. Yes. It's like all of them. Um, fine. Was there something you wanted help with while I'm up there? Oh, thank you. I, um, I used to work in a call center and I was the only person in the office that liked doing the data entry. If that answers your question, I would deliberately avoid the phone work so that I could do the data entry. I've been good about all my breaks the rest of this month, so I'm going to skip this one. Oh yeah, I can help with that. Hi, Toast. I, um, I used to do, like, uh, my mum used to do outwork when I was younger of, for stuff like rolling Christmas hats and putting the little toys and the jokes inside the hats and then rolling them up and putting the rubber bands on them. Like, literally thousands of them. And that was like my heavy place. Uh, so yeah, I'd be happy to help with that. Sounds perfect. Yeah, I mean, I need something to do with my hands most of the time anyway, so... May as well be doing something useful. I'm so excited it's gone from being like it's it's been like oh my god this is gonna be for like for, forever forever away to all of a sudden oh my god i'm getting picked up on tuesday that's fucking trippy What the heck? Why did the Cheshire cat laugh like some nefarious cougar? And I mean cougar in the sense of the older woman. Yeah. Oh. That is such a... I mean... <laughs> yeah. The, the best part about doing the rolling the Christmas cracker hats was the bags and bags and bags of little tiny rubber bands that we had. 
um, peanut butter, margarine, bread. That's all I really need. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. When I'm by myself, I don't really, uh, take particularly good care of myself. It's like, the, when I used to go, uh, house sitting, um, I would just, they'd stock up on peanut butter peanut butter, bread, and Totino's pizzas, and I'd be happy. Uh, I mean, I'm fine with water. Uh, I don't know if you have a coffee machine, or if you have coffee. Hey, Sadie! The Larry one fell! Um, but no, I'm, I'm quite happy. I, I don't need coffee or anything, really. I like... I like, yeah, I like coffee. I, like, I drink water mostly, but I do, I do like Arizona green tea, but I don't need it. Thank you, Sadie. Prepare for a vast quant- what? Okay. Is this one- No, I- please don't apologize. I am excited too. I- I said it felt like it was just like weeks away and then I when I was chatting with with Sadie and Emily I was like oh fuck that's like I've had this box on my bed that I've just been tossing little bits and pieces into of things that I want to remember so like shampoo and <laughs> okay here you go um enjoy your dinner you know that's like little bits and pieces and now I'm just like whoa yes I think Flint's getting tired of me talking about it I don't know if this pinged or not I have no idea. I probably. But yeah, as, as the time gets closer, I'm getting less anxious and more, like, exciting. No. <laughs> no, this is my trip. <laughs> you can stay at home. <laughs> I love them, but no. And honestly, you don't want to mess... He, he would 100% just wind waffles up the entire time. A hundred percent. He's, he's a brat. But yes, I have, I've been playing my craft projects. I have like a massive ball of yarn, skein of yarn for a crochet project while I'm up there. I have organized a cross stitch. So I have like a, a smaller project. So I've got things for like different levels of brain. 
this is a thousand yards or even a hundred yards of of yarn in one swirly cake. So, so yeah, I'm just tossing things in boxes and getting organized and trying to decide how much I want to do ahead of time or how little I want to do ahead of time for before I leave for, for you know dishes and chores and shit I'm just like I could just fucking leave I don't need to do any of that shit Here's the the thing. Here. Oh, there we go. Oh, hello. Uh. Oh, that's actually a window box, righto. That's interesting. I thought there might have been a leg or something. But yeah, I don't I don't really need much. I am a simple girl. <sighs> In a simple world. I keep seeing these pictures in here and being like, these would be really cute done in like silk embroidery. Or like applique. Oh, the music stopped. That's awkward. I didn't preload the playlist. Finished watching uh, Strange New Worlds last night. Star Trek, and I was so sad that it was finished. Also, there was like one episode uh, where. Uh, Spock has like tatty long hair and stubble and oh my lord he was so pretty how dear so the strange new worlds is like uh, one of the newest show newer franchises of Star Trek um, there's only two seasons of it so far on Paramount Plus. It's really fucking good. I really enjoyed it. Well, I think it was really fucking good. Nope. Um. And yeah, we finished watching it last night. I was like, no. That was after going through the slog of watching Star Trek Discovery, which was initially very good and then turned into a job. And I have my moments, I guess. It was, yeah. Like the last season 
I watched because I'd watched the first fucking seasons and I was gonna finish it if that was the last thing I'd do. <laughs> Alright, I won't I won't drop any any spoilers, don't worry about that. But Yes. I was like, I paid for this month of Paramount Plus. I'm gonna watch this fucking show. I'm gonna finish all the episodes and think we're done with that. <laughs> I was like, Ugh. But but Stranger Worlds was very good and I enjoyed that a lot. There are a couple of episodes that were a bit sort of weak, but as a whole, very much like into it. Like we watched, started watching Picard as well, and the like the first season of Picard I really enjoyed. Even though every time he would like, it would be a close up on his face, I'd start crying because he reminds me of my granddad. Um, the second season I was a little more sort of lukewarm on. Um, and also I was not expecting uh yeah like it's still it was still okay but i was just like eh. i just don't think i enjoyed this i was enjoying the story so much that i mean that it's still star trek still gotta watch it because it's star trek oh i like this door And also, Strange New Worlds, I was not expecting the captain to be, like, hot. I was not prepared for that. At all. But we basically, like I said, we had a, a, a month trial of Paramount um, and, and like, a, I went to cancel, no, I had a week trial of Paramount Plus and then I went to cancel it and they were like, would you like another month? And I was like, yeah, I'll take another month for free. And then I bought a month. It's got some bloody good shows on there. And then, just for shits and giggles, I was watching, uh, by myself yesterday, I was watching CSI New York, because I love, kind of love police procedurals. And it started, I think that one started in, like, early to mid-2000s. And I was just, like, cracking up at their, their technology is like one episode where they're trying to like triangulate where this person is in a picture and they've got this photo and you know from the photo and perspective you can absolutely figure out height and location like that's totally valid but the way they do it is they have this like picture on the screen and then this like character picks up these pictures of of the buildings and puts them on and it's like he's doing a like a kitty's jigsaw puzzle and then in another episode uh they're doing this like facial reconstruction and one of them is like oh my god this is amazing and then they show and it it's literally like a face for a morrowind and i was like oh man <laughs> oh the way technology has changed it was like it's it's uncanny and it's like it's so polys it's, it's fantastic but this was done in like 2000s or something and like all of the cast uh put on like their lab coats and they're doing a heck in science and it's it's so funny i love it it's ridiculous yeah like taking like the blurriest fucking picture you ever can and being like enhance and having it be crystal clear from a reflection from like 
20 feet away from the camera. But it, I was entertained by, by this perfect face that looks like a Morrowind character. I can't, oh, because of the ceiling. Why are you being like that? Oh, that, that's why. Yeah. Those are unrealistic, like, as I said, like, even, like, all of the cops, even the detectives are, are all doing science and, like, looking in microscopes and wearing safety glasses and white coats because that's how you do a heck in science. It's amazing. <gasps> oh, thank you. Oh, those are all really cute. Yeah, you got you can't do a science without doing the science uniform. Ooh. A couple of those are really cute, Sadie. So Oh, it's so pink. Now I don't know what we will watch. Yeah. I I really like that last one. No, because you're not a big dumb dummy. Ma'am. What did you do? Oh no! Do we need to change plans? Okay, are you sure? Okay, that's good. Okay. Um, yeah, I like the, the fourth one. Is the third one, is that one piece or two piece? Because that's cute too. A third is one piece. Pink, because I kind of, I wanted two pieces, but those are both really cute. Okay. Thank you for showing me. Organizing is hard. Okay. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, like, uh, unfortunate timing is, um, my period is due to start basically Tuesday night, Wednesday, so I may be a bit gr 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 crump. I was gonna say crampy and grumpy, and then it contracted in my head to crumpy. <laughs> so I might be a bit crumpy. Um, but I'll try and be, I'll try and self-contain it. I feel like it should, but then it also, it makes me want crumpets. <laughs> that's, <laughs> Sadie, that sounds like it's a story. I 
I, I feel like it's very specific. <laughs> and I'm, I'm intrigued. And now I want crumpets. I get, you know what, you can have hangry, so why not crumpy? Uh, yeah, well known. Traditional cure for periods. You just have a muscle relaxant and a beer and it just all goes away. Crumping is a dance move, yeah. seems like it would just make poop happen and I'm I'm pretty good at doing that myself. She was high as a kite? Oh god. Okay. I I will I will just Okay, yeah. No, I don't I don't uh. I will just say no to drugs. I will not say no to beer, but I will say no to drugs. It's fine. I do it all the time and look at me, I'm perfectly well adjusted. I mean, if I'm hot and it's cold and wet and fizzy, I'm probably going to drink it. I'm not. I'm not uh, a beer snob. I have preferences, but I'm not. I'm not picky, especially not if I'm a guest at someone's house. So, Dean, please don't get Bud Light. <laughs> especially if I'm a guest, but oh god, please. Basic white girl. Honestly, I don't really drink at the moment. Like, I'll have like a beer and I'm done. Though I might feel more relaxed around you, around you guys. Like, real comfy. But I'm just not really a drinker anymore. Wait for it. We'll get over there, and I'll just be like, "Fuck it, let's go." My my inner lush will shine, or. Tarnish. White girl wasted. I honestly, I am the cheapest date. I used to drink so much when I was at university. It was ridiculous. Like, literally gallons of beer, and I would not get a buzz or like liters of wine. And and now I'm like one bottle of beer and I'm like woohoohoo let's go a very cheap day and by let's go I mean let's go fall asleep I believe it. Hi. the cafe oh I told Ram that I was gonna be up there by the way I think you, you all forgot that you lived in the same city well you don't know but Ram and, and Dean but like, you know, close to your rounds. Cause I was like, you know, I'm gonna be up there. I might as well like 
you know, deliver the bees in person, right? And save on shipping. Yeah, he said he's not far off. Um, so... Wait, are these all like... Yeah. Oh, there we go. The bees, yes. I had them out. I was showing them off on stream again. I forgot what they were like, to be honest. They've been sitting in a little bag for a while now, since I finished them. I'll be really glad to hand them over. Because it's just been like, sitting there is like... A thing. I'm excited to see it too. I've heard a lot. I'm jelly. need any other spaces if you've got a craft room. Yeah, I was just like, oh god, can I just, yeah, get this over with. And you know, like, he's been so patient as well. Like, it's been literally years. It's nice having a creative space to hide in. Look, this is, these are gorgeous. I love these. These prints in this. Just so fascinating. Retrieve Adele. Yeah. Sounds like an online service you can hire. Need to retrieve Adele? Call oh, 1-800-GOT-BEES? Mail order Dell? <laughs> It'd be like a Delber? Dellsdongles.com I don't think Coder is maintaining that anymore. Hopefully. I think he said he'd let that one go. <laughs> A delivery. <gasps> Toast! Oh my god. How did I miss that? Toast is always quick on the mark with the, uh, the wordplay. But yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure proto-let-dells-dongles.com uh, go. Which is, you know, obviously totally fine. It's so bright and colourful.
I feel like it was very situational, you know, at the time. Oh, look at the little itty bitty store. But yes, I, I, I mean, I'm mentally I'm ready, but I still haven't prepared anything. I should probably get onto that this week. I feel like my luggage is going to be entertaining because I don't have that many clothes, but I'm probably going to have a fair amount of non-clothing. Yeah, there's going to be some stuff I'm just going to not worry about. I have a, a big pile of like sample bottles. Um, so I'm just going to pack a bunch of those for like face wash and lotion and shit. Just to use the bloody things. I can't remember if this pinged or not. No, it did not. But yeah, I keep on remembering. Like, in my head, I'm so used to trying to have everything, like, self-contained and self-reliant that it doesn't occur to me that I could just go, like, buy a toothbrush if I need to. It just, my brain's like, what? You can't do that! You can't buy toothbrushes in Ohio! What sort of cockamamie world do you think this is? Because, you know, it's so far away. Oh, okay, perfect. <laughs> you don't have a, we don't have food lion here either. Honestly, I think the last time I did a big travel, I managed to whistle pretty much everything down to like a pack of deodorant, a tiny pack of toothpaste, a toothbrush, and a pack of like body wipes. And that was it. Like face, body, sweat, you name it. Wipes just take care of the whole thing. And sure, I was a bit pimply, but... A lot less hassle. Yeah. Y'all are silly. What? 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 I don't know. Hooligans? What?
I wasn't watching anything. Time oh. Time oh, hi, Jesse. <laughs> Hello. We were just talking about my desire to act toothbrushes. I'm like, I don't know how much I use in a month, for fuck's sake. Like, how much shampoo do I need in a month? Ah. Uh -huh. Okay. What is it? I I've got a bunch of like sample bottles for for face wash and shit just because I want to try and use them, but nah. Um. No, I I actually bought my no, no, not really. Just as long as I have conditioner, I don't really care to be honest. I don't know that one. I don't know, I just use like whatever L'Oreal shit I get on sale. <laughs> Walmart or whatever. Well, I don't have any medication. I do need to call my PayPal and tell them I'll be traveling so my card doesn't get flagged for fraud. Oh, yeah, that's fine. And yeah, I would phone, I, that's fine. I don't, I don't know if I need to contact them about the, the card, but I'm not sure. It's like a business card, like a business debit, business debit card. So I was like, surely they would expect people with a, with a business account to like travel? But I figure it's probably better safe than sorry to just be like, hey, by the way, traveling out of state for a month for a business trip. If we talk about streaming at any point, it's a business trip. Yeah. So, but I have to get Flint to call them because he's actually the account holder. Um, but yeah, man, that's a difference. Yeah. But I, I don't know, I, I don't have much in the way of needs. I used to like routinely just go on like random overnight excursions and I'd just have like and if I did it in like winter I just wear like a long sleeve t-shirt with a, a short sleeve t-shirt over top so I had like two layers of clothes that way and then I just take like maybe a spare pair of undies and some panty liners and that's it I could be good for a couple of days. And then just eat at whatever random place I landed at. If I remember to eat. It's fine when you're there. Honestly, half the time, like Flint has to remind me to to eat often. As in, he'll put food in front of me, and then he'll like message me in stream and be like, "Hey, eat it." Oh, that's good. 
I mean, I will eat the I will eat the heck out of the bread. A hundred percent, I will eat the bread. I have never encountered a bread that I will not eat, unless maybe it's like moldy and gross. Everyone wants a bread, and you get a bread, and you get a bread. It's going to be like Oprah, but with bread. Yeah, we all want to get that bread, but like actually the bread. <laughs> Rather than, you know, the, the other thing. Oh, yes. Two loaves, that's one for each hand. So like, if I'm like really bad about eating, like the things that I will always eat, even when I'm feeling terrible, potatoes and bread, specifically fries, but I will always eat potatoes and I will almost always eat bread. You know I'm sick if I don't want fries. I mean, obviously, I need barbecue. It's a really weird feeling. No, wait. Oh, that sounds that sounds great. Like. I'm not this is I'm not saying it's sort of a bad thing and I'm not like asking for attention, but it's it's weird to to know that there's someone like eagerly anticipating my company. Oh Yeah. No, you're a goober. Oh no. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure Kit really doesn't give a fuck as long as she gets fed and gets to go poop. I mean, my solution would be seeing it all on fire, Jesse. I don't know if that's particularly productive. I mean, for me, it's productive, but I don't know if, you know, that would be helpful for you. I tell you guys how Daisy now gets excited every time we get an Amazon delivery because two of the drivers have started bringing her treats. So now we know when we're getting an Amazon delivery, not because Daisy is barking, 
but because she's gone quiet and if we go to the door we can see her tail wagging frantically the drivers are like oh my god she's so cute can i bring her treats it's like okay sure and so now they all bring treats for daisy <laughs> it's like girl she's got to figure it out She has. She's got them absolutely trained. Everyone's like, oh, the poor girl, look, her back legs don't work. I'm like, mate, there's nothing wrong with her brain. At all. All right, Em. Have a good rest. We're at 99%. Oh, fuck's sake. It's going to be so hard to see. Oh god. Is it in here or in here? Oh. Room ceiling arch supports. These things? Central table, window cut. Central table. Yay! I really like these summaries. Satisfaction attained. It really is a good brain fizz. All that for $200. Okay, well, thanks for popping in with the and, and rating and chats. You uh... oh, 
Okay. Yes! You will. Oh! Oh, this is gonna be really pretty. What the fuck happened in here? I forgot that I had cleaning products, but honestly, I didn't think I really needed it. Have I got extra... Well, that would have helped a lot. We've got plan plan for dinner tonight. This food thing is such a ugh, right? I really like this, like, concrete texture, plaster, I guess. I do like that they give you like interesting shapes so it's not just like square windows. And a bunch of regular circles.
don't know if that's all going to be considered one piece. Shadows are tricky. Uh, Alright, we have ads starting in 30 seconds. So, a bit time to stand up and stretch. Take a break, have a wee, get a coffee. self-care This is like one massive piece on it. These windows are so pretty. Whew. Everything's all like woven in together. that wood grain.
why is it already 11 o'clock? Jeez, today has gone so fast. Crazy fast. I just suppose I've been very absorbed in what I'm doing, so... Yes. Such excite. Well, the first few hours with that space for sale game just flew by. It's going to be interesting to see how how the streams are while I'm up there. Cuz I've got I've got an app on my phone which basically lets me turn Like working with a, an OBS plug on, it lets me turn my phone into a like a webcam. Like that's how I did like the pumpkin carving stream. So I'm almost wondering at some point if I can't just like sit up on and do like a comfy crafting stream just sitting on the couch. So I'm not like at the desk. So it'll be fun to do, like, you just have a different environment and stream as well, I think. I love these windows. try and do like details first and then the walls but I like the colors of the walls I see them
It's a carrot. Bra keeps pinching. Damn it, now you're all talking about barbecue. Maybe you want barbecue. There we go. This is a very big fireplace. It seems like it would be very efficient. Especially since it doesn't have a chimney. Appreciate the lurk.
I think this would be a great game if you were in bed sick. Especially if you had it on like Switch and you could just use your finger. So I guess your game, your screen would get pretty nasty. Everything's got that sort of droopy, dolly kind of vibe going on. I do like that they're not like too finicky about the clocks. Not sure about the chair. I guess it's carrot colored. It bothers me that the fireplace still looks grubby even though it dinged as clean.
about? Oh. Oh! Okay, I didn't know if that was gonna be a thing or not. I'm just trying to complete, like, all of the green. not sure what we're gonna do tomorrow I, I I might check out no man's sky again but I wasn't I wasn't getting the excited fizz that I was hoping for from it We've got, we've got plenty to pick from. Amongst our usual games. Oh, it's so clean. The cat's fucking terrifying. Alright, I think I'm gonna call it there. We've made good progress. We've had fun today. Um, let's see... Oh, oh you're welcome. Thanks for the company. <clears throat> What are you googly eyeing me for, ma'am? Ma'am? Alright. Have a nosy and see what the raid browser gives me. I love this raid browser. Raid browser. The 
can't. Okay. <gasps> you know what? Let's go in and... Oh. All right, I'm going to send you guys over to Alley Cat. Um, she is doing something completely different. She's doing um, a thing called Game Jam, which is like a fast paced game development thing. Uh, so you do like the whole, the whole basically the idea is to make like a game in like a week I think um, and it's a really good training thing so I'm I've only I've only spoken to her a couple of times in stream but she's really interesting so I'm like kind of fun uh, let me just check that I can actually read into her first um, here's the raid messages if you want to copy and paste those um and there's me on social. I'll see you guys tomorrow from like... Yep, I can read in. Uh, like, I don't know. From 4pm-ish, not sure exactly what we're going to do, but uh, something. Guaranteed there will be something. <sighs> um, yeah, good night. Be well. Have a good nap. Sleep. Snack. Make good choices, and I will see you all tomorrow, hopefully. Bye! -bye.